Hey guys, what's going on? Um, actually, hold on guys, I'm gonna turn it down a little bit um, because I don't want to copyright strike. Um, anyway, I just wanted to, uh, that's fine, it's, it's fine now. If it's a few seconds, it doesn't matter. Um, anyway, I just want to let you guys know, like, um, I do want to apologize for the last video where there has been some hiccups where I literally had to stop recording, restart because of one of my roommates, and I do apologize for saying anything in the videos that wasn't referring to the issue at hand. Now, that being said, um, I was going to make a rant about this because I don't appreciate it and it was not needed, nor was it right of him to do it. Um, now, it made me look stupid because you're like, what the hell is he talking about, you know? Um, actually, like, he literally face or uh, messaged me on Facebook when he knew I was recording. So, that wasn't really cool of him, and I don't appreciate it. And even Zach's like, what? <laughs> you know, uh, it comes to a point where you know better to not do something when someone's recording, especially for YouTube, where they're actually trying to make this work. Um, you know, so, and it's one thing, like, if he didn't see me recording and he just walked in, then fine, okay, I can deal with that. But the fact of the matter is he saw me literally recording, and then the fact that he walked out and then slammed the door, come on, for real, like, what are we, two? I, I mean, really, that, that, that's what annoys me, like. Stuff like that kind of, like, bothers me. Like, because it's the fact that he knew that I was doing something that I literally record all the time. And yet, it's okay for him to do it. But if I do it to his channel, A, first off, he's not as big of a YouTuber as I am. And I'm not saying I'm huge. And I never claim to be. But I have a lot more subs than him. And I usually get more views per, per um, thing. He's got one that's hit more than me. But that's fine. I don't care about that. But the fact of the matter is you you want to be part of my channel, but yet you decide to cut off my channel. What logic does that make to me? I don't understand. It doesn't add up. Um, and uh, my friend's playing uh, WWE, so if you hear that joystick, that's why. Um, no, you're, you're fine. It's not a big deal. Um, see, like that, that's nothing. I don't care about that. You know, that's not really noise. Um, but no, but if you want me to help you with your channel and then you decide, oh, I'm going to fuck with this channel, why would I help you? I, I just, so guys, um, just for the record, if don't go to like his channel and bash him, I don't care what he does. You know, it's not that. In fact, I don't love his channel in general and he knows it because I'm not a big fan of, uh, loud noises. And he likes fire alarms and whatever. I subbed to him because he's all, only because he's my roommate. And it wouldn't be right if I didn't. Because he subbed to me. So I do sub back. Sub sub. Blah, blah, sub for sub. Um, but at the same time, he knows I will never be in his part of his channel. Because I don't like loud noises. So, again, that's the reason. And um, if you guys don't know that about me... I do have um, sensitive sensitivity issues. Um, I don't really talk about it because I usually can deal with it, you know. Um, and everyone else knows that. So um, anyway, I just want to let you guys know, and I want to personally apologize that usually I wouldn't even looked at it or anything. I would have just ignored it, but and that was my fault. So sorry, guys. My bad, guys. My bad. All right, guys. Hit that like button if you haven't. Subscribe if you have not. See you in the next video. Peace out.